right into some gameplay. Playing the aisle today. Uh, I'm actually continuing on a fresh uh, shant hatchling. Um, hoping Mad Bars may be joining me in a bit, maybe some of the other community members, but as of right now, I am frightened and alone. I'm just a little guy. Coming along uh, with development of Ibrima, we still have a while before I'm going to start streaming it. Um, I really want the AI to get polished up before we dive too deeply into that. But once the AI is done, I think I'm going to start doing that um, more regularly. Hey, how you doing? Oh, a bunch of familiar faces already. How's everyone doing today? Could be worse off. How's school going? Miss Dudash, I'm doing okay. Um, I was feeling a little nauseous before for no good reason, though it could be the third cup of coffee I'm on, but. Took some tums and I'm uh, right as rain. <clears throat> Reading through the Odyssey. It is a good read. Do you have to read the Iliad too or just the Odyssey? Very cool. Is it like a, a cultural uh, cultural arts sort of thing? Hey, Bezaruni, you can. Uh, I'm on Bio Isle right now playing a hatchling shant. Um, but you could uh, you could actually persuade me to uh, to hop servers if you wanted. I'm down. I'm down for it. <clears throat> World lit. Nice. Very cool.
So what's new and exciting, uh, Doodash? Yeah, Bezad, I uh, I started this mail shant uh, just the other day, so we're only 65% of the way towards uh, fresh adult, and it's a male, so I can't actually nest in. So we're going to have to figure out uh, getting together. Um, if you want, you can jump into the voice uh, Discord server, and we can chat. I'm up at Gord at the moment, so... There's not a lot of action, so it's sort of nice for me to grow a little bit before anything major happens. Uh, Mad Bars might be joining us. Let's see what he has to say. He just went over another year. <laughs> yeah, it looks like Mad Bars will probably be joining us, which is cool. I see my auto alerts are now working, which is nice. Back at work. Very cool. Yeah, yeah, that's fine, Beza. Just that way I don't have to slam at my keyboard on the stream. I can just chat with you verbally is nice. But I'll be able to read whatever you type. Yeah, Stego, perfect. Cool. I like mixed herds. Always have. Juvie Chance needs so much water. So much water. I started playing Beast of Bermuda also. Um, I have mixed thoughts. Overall, I like the game. It feels different than the Isle. And they do have access to some different dinosaurs, which is cool. Um, Overall, I like the Isle better, but Beast of Bermuda is a nice break now and then. We're just gonna chill by this bush for a bit. nice to spice things up from time to time even if it's some similar content well it's it's its own genre now dinosaur survival games are really its own genre uh which is kind of amusing i i love it as a dinosaur fan but um oh you can't sniff oh. um <clears throat> can you swap the stego Yeah, I mean, I don't see why not. Um, you know, so you've got different different games in the genre. You've got The Isle, you've got Beast of Bermuda, you've got Path of Titans. Um, there's another one. I can't remember what the fourth one's called, but there's another one. They're all dinosaur survival games, very specifically. And they all do something a little bit differently. Um... I find that the Isle is the most semi-realistic of them, um, in that, like, you don't have access to an in-game map, and you can't see a health bar, and things, like, it just tries to immerse you as much as possible, just like, you're a dinosaur doing dinosaur things. Um, Beast of Bermuda has very clear health bars, and, um... Their, their overlay is a little more informative, I'd say. And they include a lot more stuff. They have, like, comfort levels, so, like, during storms, your comfort drops, and when predators are around, your comfort drops, and things like that. Your comfort increases around uh, other creatures of your species, things like that. Um, and there's just a lot more that affects your dinosaur from your environment. Like, you can eat certain plants and stuff that increase your comfort, or you can get food poisoning, and there's a whole bunch of other stuff. Um... 
and their nesting mechanics are actually better. I do like their nesting mechanics better in Beasts of Bermuda, and it involves both males and females, which is something the Isle is going to be introducing but has not done yet. Um, Path of Titans is very different from both of them, and is more of an RPG. Like, Path of Titans is more forgiving in that if you lose your dinosaur, you don't, like, lose it for good. You just spawn back in. It's just like a character, almost like a, a typical massive uh, online multiplayer game. Uh, and they have, like, quests, and you can join guilds and stuff, so it's, it feels very, very different. Um, but obviously you're still playing dinosaurs. It's still got the survival aspect of looking for food and water and, and things like that. So they're, they're very different games with very different philosophies, but they all fit in this genre of dinosaur survival, so I'm enjoying having access to all of them and you know, sometimes I'm in the mood for sort of like, I don't want to worry too much about losing things, and I just want to cruise for a while as a dinosaur, I'll play Path of Titans, or, um, you know, if I want something that I feel like, you know, you have the talent system and stuff in Beast of Bermuda, I feel it's a little more interactive sometimes, so I'll play that, plus they have Apatosaurs and marine reptiles and stuff, which is cool, so, I'll, you know, that's something I can't do in the aisle that I can do there, and then there's, there's this game. <coughs> Yeah, well, uh, Nova, if you want to get uh, Beasts of Bermuda or, or Path of Titans, I'd, I'd play with you for sure. We got nighttime coming. Hello. Yay, how you doing, Mad Bars? Doing well. Uh, trying to get the aisle on my brand new. I got a 27 inch monitor. Wow. So I'm uh, trying to get it to go onto the screen I want it to. Uh, this is going to be. Uh, we'll try this one time. So Beza, you're gonna you're gonna die so you can swap the hatch and stego. What do you think you're gonna swap into? So if you want to go for a um, an apex, you know we could use a trike, obviously. Um, if you want to go sub apex, um, I would suggest either a Maya or where is that freaking bush? I forgot how long it takes to find. Uh server. Yeah, it takes a little while. Here we Jeez. go. It just didn't walk far enough. There's actually plenty of food around, which is nice. It's quiet up at Gord here tonight. <coughs> yeah, I was going to say para, para is actually Para or Maya. Um, you're going to do the trike? Awesome. So that's two, that'll be two apexes when we're fully grown. I think I'm gonna go para. Para, when I, uh, I like it. Actually, uh, when I actually uh, get onto the. <laughs> there we go. It only took five minutes. All right. Here we're gonna do this. <clears throat> All right, where are you? Uh, Gord, way up north. Well, taking a while to get there. Yes, Gord. Gord is um, west southwest of Ocean Falls. I want to play on this big screen, but it's actually it's it is so not what I should be doing in order to have the map up. Ah. All right. Nova says, Trike, Para, and Shant. Nice little power trio. <laughs> so, 
except we're all going to be babies, so I don't know how much power the trio is going to have for a while. <laughs> Percent to fresh. Gord is actually where we shot that. Um, I need a hero video. <laughs> <laughs> Well, I'm at a south, south of sinkhole. Yeah, you're really far south. Uh, it's, it, but, you know, by the time I get to Gord, it'll be time for me to go to bed. Should be perfect. Alternatively, you can, nearby. Alternatively, you can make a uh, a galley and just sprint to us. Ah. Uh. <laughs> I'm sorry, I must have been confusing you with with uh with Ever who loves his little fight chickens. <laughs> there's an Ava over here which tells me there's also a sort of Hungry Carnivore. Yeah. Oh, I forgot how slow paras are. I haven't played this game in a while. I've played so much fall guys. I like Fall Guys, but I only have so much tolerance for it. In what way? I can only play a couple rounds, and it's... I guess there's not enough maps for me. Like, it just gets kind of it's kind of repetitive, and I... I lose interest. Yeah, Are you allowed to chill on the beach here? Are you allowed to chill on the beach? Yeah. About no kill on the beach. Um, juvies can kill juvies on the beach. Adults oh, can't well. kill adults can't kill juvies on the beach. <clears throat> Alright, well I we'll hope this giga doesn't fuck me up. Is he a juvie? Well there's a juvie and a and a sub adult. Doesn't really seem um, fair they would have. No, but I think this sub I think the sub can actually attack you. If they do, they do. If they do, I'll make a galley. You might be able to outrun them at that size, though. Well, they're right in my way, so I kind of have to go through them. <laughs> and just hope that they're... Uh... Literally honk at them as you pass. Get out of the way! This map is large. This is a large map. I apologize for being way the hell out of the way, but this is where I hatched, so I didn't go very far. It's okay. I just wish you had a, uh, I wish you had a, uh, egg. I know, I, if I was a female and could, uh, nest you in, but no, I'm, uh, a boy shant for the first time. When given the choice, I, I prefer to play as females because I like to nest people in, and right now only females can do that in the aisle. So, I like how Beast of Bermuda does um, nesting. Males are the ones who actually lay the nests, and then females place the eggs in them. And then, instead of the females sitting on them and incubating them, um, they just invite people to the eggs, 
and then you actually spend the just like the incubation period in the egg and you can like see out but it looks like this blurry red vision like that you're looking through the membrane of the egg and so you can see you have this limited field of vision that you can actually see other dinosaurs around you and stuff and it's interesting I do like Beast of Bermuda. The gra if, if the graphics of Beast of Bermuda were a little bit better, if they were more on par with the Isle, at this stage in, in the Isle's development, I probably would prefer Beast of Bermuda. But mind you, if Reem is going to take that up a notch and, and be even more impressive, I think, than Beast of Bermuda. But all things considered, even though right now I, I fall into the Isle's camp, it's primarily because of visuals. But Beast of Bermuda has... Um, I think more intriguing systems in place. It has like actual tidal systems where the tide rises and falls, which can create um, land bridges across water, or vice versa, can flood areas that allow uh, marine reptiles access further inland. Um, they have cooler abilities for the different dinos, like. Mosasaurs grab things and drown them. They can drag them underwater and drown them. Um, oh, hold on. See me where is uh, giving me a call. Uh, so yeah, it's it's interesting the differences. The, the coloration, the the, um, the color palettes that you can choose for the dinosaurs, you have a lot more customization in Beast of Bermuda also, which is nice. And they actually have some colors that you can only get by being nested in. And they also, with their talent system, you can actually inherit certain talents from your parents that let you get a higher max value on them. Yeah. So am I. I'm, I'm just okay at hearing it over the music. I have it turned down to a reasonable level. I do like the game music though. It's nice, it also, um, the game music gives you an idea of time because like it just played because it hit midnight and that's why I played some music. So it, it plays at like certain time intervals. Did those gig gigas give you any trouble? Yeah, I know, it is amusingly chipper. <laughs> how are they hearing you? Or how do they hear you? Or how, how do you hear them? How do I hear who? Uh, the people that you're talking to. Uh, I'm watching the stream chat. On my uh, other okay. screen. So... They hear me because they're watching the stream and then they're typing in chat. It's very non unintrusive of them. I flawed them because I just I just come into Discord and just <laughs> It's just BS. Yeah. It's my platform. <laughs> to lay out my political agenda. <laughs> first things first, we're gonna get more rainforest cafes. We need more of them. There's not enough. 
If you're going to lay out a political agenda, it has to be game related. That's the only rule for the stream. Uh. <laughs> Unless you were talking about adding rainforest cafes to the aisle. I mean, it wouldn't be it wouldn't be the worst thing in the world. <laughs> when they add humans, they must also add rainforest cafe. Where is sinkhole? Sinkhole is south west of where I am. I'm trying to get to it. Oh. You you started in Gulf? Yeah. Northeast of Gulf. Yeah. No, I'm I have it in front of me. A far ways away. And I hear footsteps, which makes me very nervous. <laughs> As will it need... As will it should. Just wanna find some food. There's no food. Hard to be a dinosaur. Yes. Rain got me. Nova says, Rainforest Cafe, did I hear that right? Then yes, I agree, because those were so much fun. I, want, I went a few times as a kid. We need to make Rainforest Cafe great again. So they have Rainforest Cafe. Um, there's two I've been to in the last decade. One, the Sunrise Mall one is closed. That's closed. The, in the last decade, the one in, in uh, Disney World. They have one at uh, the entrance of Animal Kingdom in Disney World. Oh, so, yeah, that's true. Which yeah. is thematically appropriate. So I've been to that one in the last decade. And then um, Steph and I, for our um, honeymoon, we went to Niagara Falls, and they have a Rainforest Cafe in Niagara Falls. I used to just go to the one at Sunrise Mall a lot, and then they closed it. I, I know. Mean, that's really where everything started going down the hole. <laughs> Hey, Stamp, how's it going, ma'am? Seeing so many familiar faces tonight. How are ya? How's the, uh, the Marvel Alliance treating ya? Loving more lately, huh? <clears throat> uh, no, we're actually both native to New York, although Zach... Are you back in Arizona, Zach? I am back in Arizona. Back in as Arizona. Of Saturday. Uh, but we both, we both grew up on Long Island in New York. Long Island. Long Island. Island. <laughs> Forget about it. The Mets, am I right? <laughs> <laughs> Bagels with cream cheese. Bagels with cream cheese. I think that's what everyone knows us for. <laughs> I mean, that, yeah, I mean, well, now I'm big. Also, the Chinese food out here still haven't found anything that great. That's if anyone has any great suggestions for Ar Phoenix, Arizona, uh, you know, Chinese food by all means of all years. <laughs> You guys probably have no taste as to what is really good Chinese food, so take your suggestions and shove them up your butt. <laughs> You've only ever seen a Rainforest Cafe in Florida when going to visit. So so I guess there's more than one, unless you were talking about the one in Disney. I'm guessing there's more than one in Florida. This one bush is like the everlasting bush. It just will not diminish. That's what my dad said about my mom. <laughs> I don't even. I, the second I said it, I regretted okay. it okay. instantly. It's, it's, the, the divorce, it's all over. <laughs> there's one at Disney Springs, there's a couple, I guess. Can I plug Goldie's new uh, Instagram on your Twitch stream? Uh, yes. Okay, everybody, go follow Goldie the Gecko. Uh, some of you have have heard Dan and I talk about Goldie before. He's my leopard gecko. He's he's yellow, hence the name Goldie. And he's on Instagram now, so go check him out or don't. I'm not your dad. 
<laughs> I wouldn't want to be. I'm really not interested in that kind of lifestyle. So. <laughs> Don't it's even true. get any idea. It's true. He hates children. I do. For the most part, yes. Although I've gotten better with that. I'm still fun uncle. I can handle yes. being fun uncle. I was fun uncle a lot this summer. Uh, you you discovered for a lot of it, yes. <laughs> but you've discovered the joy of uh, responsibility free uh, children. Yeah, I mean, my niece got a really bad burn and scar, but besides that, in my opinion, I put the we were doing s'mores, and I put the stick very far away from her, thinking, "Oh, I don't want her to grab this." Still found it. Um, <laughs> and, uh, I don't know. Apparently, apparently, the dad got in trouble with the mom <laughs> for being around the fire. <laughs> I don't know. I'm, it's not my responsibility. It's not my kid. So if you, if you don't if you don't want your kid touching hot pokers, then you know. Nova is very much an animal person, and she says, "All oh, little 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 lizard friend, don't have Instagram, but sending some loves for the tiny friend." That's fine. I don't have Instagram either. So. <laughs> Just the lizard. Just the lizard. <laughs> yeah, and I made. I tried to make an account, and I said that that I wasn't cool enough, and that I couldn't do it. <laughs> Said stick to Tumblr. <laughs> stick to Tumblr. <laughs> All right, I think I'm at sinkhole now. I yeah, but I'm at do. How you doing, Doctor Zeppers? I'm Good making a lot you. of noise, though. You're making a lot of noise at sinkhole. That is sure. That is a surefire way to attract some predators to where you are. Yeah, and I, I know that there are some around too, so. <laughs> what's, I, what's lay down again? Z? Uh, H. H is to lay H. down. Zeppers, how was your uh, your stream? I didn't catch that. The last stream you did for Star Wars. Oh, thank you so much for subscribing. I really appreciate that. Well, I'm at West Swamp. I'm not at Sinkhole. Uh, I do not want to be at West Swamp. Ugh. No, you do not want to be at West Swamp. You're going to be part of the GAC chain gang starting Wednesday night? That's awesome. That's really cool. They get a lot of viewership, don't they? Oh, Nova, thank you for subscribing with Prime. Oh, there's something here. Can you tell what it is? Nope. I you see can... its eyes. Oh, you see its eyes. Oh, I hate that. Um, is your butt fully clenched or just half clenched? It looks like it looks like a carno, a, carno, a carnivore of some sort. Uh, Zeppers will be closing out the chain, doing your GAC, and then moving into your show. Awesome! Glad to hear it. I have to. I have to definitely catch it. I'm, I'll make a note of it. I've been so bogged down with work lately. I've been missing a lot of people's streams. Alright, he doesn't want to mess with me. He's a little baby carno. Mm, get the hell out of there just the same. Seeing the eyes in the dark. Yes, that's terrifying. He too called me, so... Okay. That's promising. I still don't trust them, but... That's promising. Well, I'm just, I'm just running north. Although, you can just follow my tracks, but whatever. Uh, if you need to, get into the water when you can, and then walk a little bit in the water, and then peel off, and he should lose you. I'm already way far away from the water. I was like, well, I'm just gonna try to run. He seemed nice, though. I don't think he was trying to mess with me. Yeah. I, th I think I could probably take him, right? 
The server is pretty light today too. You Juvie think you can take him as Juvie. a para? Um, if he's if Juvie? Yeah, Juvie vs Juvie, I think you got a shot. I think you got a shot. No, yeah, you know what? You definitely have a shot because, as shown in the I Need a Hero video, Amaya stomped out a Karno. <laughs> yeah, there you go. Which I never, ever, ever would have called. <laughs> Beza, how you doing with that trike? He's still in chat. Did we lose him? There's a Rooney. Let me see if he's typing in the Discord. I do not believe he is. Two percent on the way to fresh result. Come along, I see. I do like the coloration of the male chance better, but as I said, I prefer playing females so that I can nest. Before the chant, I was playing a, uh, a giga on this server, and uh, I made it to adult. I know, I know, dude, Ash. I love how um, relaxing this game is compared to some of the other games I play. When you're not being hunted, of course, or hunting someone else. Uh, um, <clears throat> hunting Carnos. So. Ram path. I was playing an adult Giga. I hooked up with another adult Giga. We had two Jubies with us. We had just caught up with the Jubies on the beach and were leading them to water. The one adult logged. I got the two Jubies to the water nearby, like drinkable water nearby, and two adult Rexes, full adult Rexes came out. And I fought uh, valiantly, uh, but they, they took me down. The Jubies got away, but. That'll happen. I know, I oh, was God so damn it, disappointed. Oh, Ava away from me. <laughs> Ava, like, spawned right on top of me. <laughs> That's almost good, because then you can hide your tracks with its tracks. So they're just going to think it's running around like an idiot. Uh, Juicebox said any para. Do you want to group up with that para? <laughs> uh... Come on, go kill that Ava. There they are. Alright, kill that Ava. I'm telling you, this is the chonkiest bush. It just won't deplete. Yeah, run away. Run away that way, Ava. No, wrong way. You 
you've been juke like that before is a Utah there was a young devil and an Ava and I couldn't tell which <laughs> you were following by the tracks oh that's funny Is my waterfall right now There's that cheerful music again. You're all alone and only a child, but don't worry, nothing to fear. Yeah, Zeppers, unfortunately, I lost I lost my last chant, and then I made a Giga, got the Giga to a full-grown adult, now I lost that in short order, because really, I'm not that good at this game, for anyone who watches the stream regularly. Um, that should be fairly, fairly obvious, but we're almost a, a fresh adult, at least, we're 86% of the way to a fresh adult. Um, ooh! I just got invited to a shant group. Way far away. Good luck with that. So there's a herd near Great Falls. Uh, we could try to head that way. I just need to get a little bigger so I can actually survive the trip because I need way too much water as a hatchling. You remember the Gigas we were playing? Those were fun. We did really well. Yeah, that was on a different server, but I think those probably got deleted, uh, Nova. So, if you want to change up and head to Great Falls, Zach, I can try to head that way too. Uh, let me see where I'm at. I believe I'm at Fields River. And I know that there was AI that just spawned near me. Again? <laughs> Yeah, like, like, I look, there's less than 100 people on the server right now, like, how, what, what the fuck is going on here? Well, but you're, you're in the area that is the most densely populated because it's near spawning areas. Uh. Nova, you're always welcome to play. Always, always. Guardian Rock. That's Guardian Rock. 
Oh, finally. The bush finally uh, dissipated, but we have uh, we have plenty in the area to keep me fed until it's time to get a move on. And then we have to make a great migration towards uh, Great Falls, which is a dangerous proposition. Oh, you want to go all the way to Great Falls? Want, want to is a strong word, but I was invited to a herd with a, another shant, and they are currently at Great Falls. Well, I am at Field River. It wouldn't be terribly far for you to go. For me, it's going to be... Well, I would just wait for you. You meet up with them. Okay, I'm not going to go all the way to Great River by myself after coming all the way from Gold. <laughs> Taking me 45 minutes to get this far. I'm not even gonna get to Gord. Oh, you think you're you're close to Gord? I'm not. No, I'm not even close to Gord. They weren't calling us lunch. No, I'm not Field River. Cur currently in the aisle, the one thing that's sort of nice, I think, it, it it can be frustrating, but it can also be nice. Is you can only get invited to a group um, if they're the same species as you. So the guy who invited me is another shant, for sure. And then he said he's got other friendly herbivores nearby, so... Um... I'm pretty confident that he's not... I'm confident he's not scamming me. It gets a little fishier when you're a carnivore, because then, like, a bigger carnivore can be like, yeah, yeah, I'll take care of you, and then just turn you into lunch. But for herbivores, you have a little bit of a, a safety in that you know that whatever's inviting you to a group eats leaves. Chants are gigantic, even as hatchlings, which are so big. So you are currently, um, west of me. And south of me. Okay. Do you want to meet at Forest Falls? Uh, let me take a look. Or we could meet at. Well, if you're, if you're actually trying to get to Great Falls. I don't know yet. So, let's show the audience where we currently are. So we are currently up here by Gord. You want to meet where now? Uh, Forest Falls, due south? Forest Falls. Or we could, I mean, we could be that ravine. Um, where we meet up is probably where I'm going to log. Because it's probably going to take me another half hour, 45 minutes to get to there. Just to get there, right. Uh, 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 uh. We could try. You're you're probably faster than me at this point. Um, we could try to meet up at Splash and see how that goes. It's just going to be a long trek for me as a little guy, but I think I can do it. I think this is a pretty safe part. Uh, I'm not so much Field worried River. about. I'm not so much worried about safety. I'm more worried about my water, my hydration, because ba um, baby shants are yeah. crazy thirst generators. Um, you essentially have to beeline it. Yeah, no, I can't. I I'm can't stop. That's a long place to go. Yeah, that's why Gord is safe very often, is because it's really the hell out of the way. Um, let's go have a nice little leafy meal.
I mean, as it is, I'm still gonna be like no threat to most carnivores when I'm a fresh adult, but at least then I will have more of a tank for food and water, you know? Yeah. I'm 90%. Think of 84%, 83%. Is that to, uh, powers don't have sub-level, do they? Nah. It's a fault. No, that's, that's too adult, okay. That is due south for me. Alright, let's get brave, kids. Where are you going? I'm gonna start heading south. I, I have to get to Splash regardless, because that's the closest body of water yeah. to where I am. And then from there, we're gonna see how we do. Should I just chill on Fields River? No, yeah, I go through here anyway. Eh? Head, head up towards Splash. The farther uh -huh. north you go, the safer you're going to be anyway. Generally. Yeah, that's true. Get some stand back. All right, full stand. Go. I will probably hit Fresh Adult on the way. I am at Forest Falls. Hey, Dudash, thanks so much for the biddies. Thanks for stopping by. Love seeing you in the stream, and I will try not to get eaten by mean dinos. Have a good night. So I have to go south, southwest. <laughs> 
Yeah, I had the option to uh, to change that, and I decided not to. I decided to leave it at Poggers. This little leafage to munch on on the way. I'm gonna head off and keep this para growing. Okay. For next time. Sounds good. I will see y'all later. Peeps, have a good night. Enjoy your stuff. Okay. Have a good night, man, boys. Peace. We actually did okay with water. I think uh, I'm large enough that I'm not in too much trouble as long as I am responsible about going from water source to water source. currently at splash so I should follow this around and then go due south to catch um, forest river Just clean off our tracks a little bit so if anyone Follows the trail we were leaving. They will likely lose it. Can't get under there. Damn it. Whatever. I'll go around this way and it's fine.
and we're heading to two two chants now and our herd. I saw something down there, so I'm going to avoid it as much as possible. There it is. Uh, it looks to be a Rex. Let's not meet him. Would be great. Two of them it looks like. Oh boy. Let us steer quite clear of them. Out. They saw me through the trees, so we should be okay. Water up ahead. I can't tell if that's a dinosaur up there.
Thank you, thank you. Uh, you know what? I think I'm going to be ending the stream now anyway. I don't think we're going to make it to them tonight, but uh, I will take down their info and we'll try to uh, meet up with them during the next stream. Uh, in the meantime, good night, everyone. Thanks so much for stopping by. Thank you to Dr. Zeppers and Nova for the subs. Thank you, Judash, for the bits. Uh, I will see you guys for the next one. Thanks for hanging out.